problem 617 uh, asks us to calculate the diffusion flux J in a system of oxygen diffusing through low density polyethylene. Thankfully we can assume conditions of steady state which means J is equal to our um, permeability coefficient, which is similar to our diffusion coefficient for metals, multiplied by the change in pressures from the top and the bottom, or left to right, you know, the two sides of the membrane, change in pressure over the thickness of the membrane. Since it's steady state, we can assume it's linear, uh, thus our deltas rather than a uh, differential. If we look up our permeability coefficient for low density polyethylene, of oxygen going through low density polyethylene, on table 6.4 it's 2.2 if we look up our if we look up the permeability coefficient of oxygen through low density polyethylene on table 6.4 we find that it is 2.2 times 10 to the negative 13 and we have units of centimeters cubed at standard temperature and pressure centimeters over centimeters over centimeters squared seconds pascals. So we multiply this times change in pressure. Pressure on one side is 2,000 kilopascals and the other is 150 kilopascals. And that is all over the change in X which is a 15 millimeter thick piece of LDPE or 1.5 centimeters. Okay, so this ends up as 2.2 .2 times 10 to the negative 13th centimeters cubed at STP centimeters over centimeters squared seconds pascals and 2 million pascals minus 150,000 pascals will be 1,850,000 pascals all over 1.5 centimeters. So we can cancel out some of these units 
centimeters and centimeters, pascals, pascals. These all remain. So, doing the math, we get 2.7 times 10 to the negative sixth centimeters cubed STP over centimeters squared seconds. And That is our final answer. The units are uh, somewhat confusing, um, but it's important to make sure that they uh, stay the way they are in order to reference them back to standard temperature and pressure.